Hey guys, this is Exoscare, and today we're going to be going over CUDA Miner, which is actually designed to work better and give you better hashing power with your NVIDIA card. CG Miner, of course, is uh, designed to work better with AMD. But uh, let's go and hop into this. I'll go ahead and post the link to CUDA Miner download in the info for the video. Uh, also, just to let y'all know, I am using version uh, 07.13.2013. Uh, I know that there are newer versions out, but I find this one to be stable for me, and that's the one that I'm using. Um, just to start off, I guess in case people don't know how to create a bat file, if you're on Windows, go and extract. Once you're down, done downloading CUDA Miner, extract all the files to one folder. Inside that same folder, go ahead and hit Alt, go to Tools, Folder Options, View. Make sure that hide extensions for known file types is unchecked. Hit apply and then hit OK. That'll allow you to create your uh, your bat file. Now in the same folder, go ahead and right click, go to new text document. I already have an example set up here, so we'll go ahead and open that. Alright, and inside this, you're going to want to put kudaminer.exe space two hyphens no hyphen autotune. What that's going to do is it's going to disable the autotune feature. Whenever you start up kudaminer, it generally tries to look for, um, for the best uh, intensity for it, but we're going to try and turn that off. I know a lot of people have been having issues where if they try and do the auto-tune normally, it will just open and close. So we'll try and run it this way for everybody to see if uh, we get better results. So after the no auto-tune, put another space, hyphen, lowercase d, space, and a zero. And what this is going to do is it's going to force it to recognize the first device or the first GPU that you have installed on your PC, which should be an NVIDIA card. Uh, then another space, hyphen, an uppercase I, and then put in 24x3. And that's more or less uh, the intensity. Uh, unlike CG minor, where the intensity ranges from 1 to 20, I want to say, this one looks more like a mathematical symbol. Or a mathematical equation, sorry, not a symbol. After that, put a space, another hyphen, lowercase m and zero and this should actually help if you're using Vista it, it should reduce the memory usage put another space hyphen lowercase o and you can actually use whatever link or whatever pull link you are uh, on right now uh, I'm using WDC coin mine um, if you're using Cointron or whatever else It'll basically be the same thing. Just go ahead and copy the strat and link in the port right into this area. After the link in the port, go ahead and put another space, a hyphen, an uppercase O, and then go ahead and put in your username, or your worker username. Sorry about that. Then a little space bracket and your password. Now when you go to save this, be sure not to save it as a TXT. Go and erase TXT and replace it with BAT. Bat, just like the little flying creatures. Now if we go back in here, you can notice that the pull bat's created right above the pull text. So you can always delete the text file afterwards, you don't really need it. But that's really about it, guys. Um, very simple to use. This should hopefully get everybody up and running. If you happen to have any issues with it, just go ahead and let me know, and I will do my best to help you out. Enjoy, guys.